Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to, uh, well, I guess that's going to be uh, Fingers Valley in Transport Fever 2. Okay, so I'm looking over here, um, get that out of the way, uh, and there's a clear issue here uh, with these four tracks, the main line tracks in this road. That's going to be a traffic jam, isn't it? So uh, it became obvious to me as soon as I looked at that, that I need to uh, make this into a great separated uh, operation here. So that's going to require bulldozing a bunch of stuff. So this, this, this. Oh, that was dumb. Uh, okay. Uh, do this. Uh, take that out, that out, that out, that, and that, okay. Um, yeah, there's no way I'm going to get from there over or under, so we'll take this out, back to there, uh, back to here. Um... You know, you didn't need to bulldoze quite that much. Yeah, I know. Uh, so, what we're going to do is... Uh, nope. That will work. Yeah, that'll work, but... You know what? I'm just going to go with that. Yeah. Okay, we'll go with that. Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's going, going to work. Um, okay, do this. Uh, yeah, do it like that. Yep, we can get away with a, oh, we want to curve that, right? Yeah. Okay, and then we want to come off of here, straight-ish, yeah, uh, kill that, do that, yep, yeah. and we need to do the same thing over here, yeah, yeah, we do, uh, so, that's acceptable, uh, yep, and we put a crossing here, yep, okay, take this out back to here, I guess you did need to take that much out, yeah, I guess I did, no, no, do it this way, yeah, yeah, okay, and then this can come around like that and like that. Yep. Got to do the same thing over here. Yep. Definitely. Okay. Yeah. Do I want to... Do I... No. I'll just... Uh, I'll just come around like this. Yeah, okay. Now, that will allow all the, uh, all the traffic to get over the uh, rail line without conflicting. Yeah, that, uh, that does seem like it's probably a good idea. And that bridge gives enough room for uh, for more tracks or even a road or two under there. Oh, why, why there's so many trucks heading out this way? I added more trucks to this uh, coal mine because seriously, uh, uh, the rate is uh, way too uh, way too uh, what or was way too low. Um, right and if we come in here we can see that coal is the limiting factor here uh, so we need to catch the coal up right 
yeah, catching the coal up is definitely the way to go. Um, yeah. What are you doing? Building roads. Oh. Yeah, why are you building roads? Uh, because I can. Oh, because you can. Uh, does that mean you should? Probably not. Okay, well, as long as you know that, uh, you do realize that talking to yourself is just dumb, right? Well, I'd heard tell about that, yeah. Well, if you heard tell about it, why are you doing it? Because I can. Oh, no, no, we're not, we're not going there. That's going to be circular. Oh, is it now? Yeah, it definitely is. Well, stop doing it then. Okay. Um, well, we have coal showing up here. That does seem like it's useful. Uh, we might want to do something with the steel. Uh, where would we... Do, where would we take the steel from here? We wouldn't. We don't have anywhere we can take it. No, we don't. Hmm. This, um... Iron mine's going to go away. That's fine. Uh, we're not uh, we're not going to be too broken up if that happens. Um, where is the nearest steel consumer? Over here. Yeah. Um. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing... Well, there's one down here. Yeah, that's a long way away. So, what you're saying is you need to uh, build... Oh, there's one here. So, you need to build a hub at Pueblo, is what you're saying. Yeah, I suppose that is what I'm saying. Well, then why don't you? You know what? That's a good pro project. It is a good project. Okay. So take this road out. That's probably more road than you needed to take out. Probably. Um, you, you're doing the flattening gun. Yeah. I did the same thing at the other, other hubs, too. Um, you're putting it there, are you? Yeah, thought I might. Okay, well, if you're going to do that, you're going to need a, uh, a station. Uh, it's going to be a cargo station you need. Yeah, cargo station. 324, no catenary. And we'll put it here. That's about the right angle. Uh, bam. So that's going to be Pueblo Freight Hub. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh, configure it. Uh, we don't need uh, these. No. Uh, tracks. Yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, so we bring the tracks out to here. Yeah, we're building really long uh, hub stations here. One, two, three, four. So they're... Uh, I'm building them really long uh, platforms. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Um, so I guess this would make it uh, 
make these uh, 640 meters. Well, this one anyway. Uh, is 640 meters okay? Yeah, yeah, it is. Um, okay, so we uh, we take this road here out. Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to need tracks, which are going to be this kind, with no catenary. No, we're going to bring you out flat and straight to there. And then you there, yeah, you there, yeah, uh, take you out, yeah, there we go. Then you come into here, just like so, yeah, so there's the, uh, the four uh, main tracks there and then we need to come up this way okay so yeah that seems about right do that yeah you know having a sharp bend here is going to slow the trains down these are freight trains they're not going to be going faster than 100k generally Oh, right. That is a point, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so we need to come down here where we're going to do the same uh, business. Yeah. Uh, kind of like this. Uh, do this. Yeah. Do that. Yeah. Do that. Do that. And this. Yeah, okay. So now we've got the same uh, same four tracks coming out of there. Um, we need to get it over there. I think we're going to have to go through this. Does look that way, doesn't it? So if we come through here, um, that's going to be a that's going to be a tunnel. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess we're going to do that with a tunnel. Uh-huh. So we come up here. And another one up here. Yeah. And the fourth track up there. Now, uh, I think we need to back this up just a smidge. Yeah, okay. Now, we need to bend slightly this way. So we bend slightly that way. Yeah. And then we come in from here, bending slightly that way. You know what? That works. Okay, we can we can live with this. So now you need to build the uh, road crossing, or yeah, the road crossing. Okay, so build the road crossing. Well, that's what I'm doing. Uh, yeah, I suppose it is, isn't it? Yep, yeah, it is. Uh huh. That's the only road crossing on this, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, well, so so this isn't uh, too hard. To, what? Uh, try it this way. Yeah. Yep, that works better. And then we've got a really. Let's uh, let's come from this way. Yeah, we'll come from this way. Uh, okay. Now. Right. And good. 
now connect these. Yeah, okay, connecting them. Uh, good and good. Okay, so that's a uh, connection down to there. Uh, we'll put signals on that later once we know what we need. Uh, and this is going to have to come in around here. So, um, oh, no, the tracks are going to go through that gap. Okay. Well, if the tracks are going through that gap, uh, okay, we can, uh, we can put them in, uh, so we come in to about here. And then there. And then that comes out. Yeah. You connect there. You connect there. Yep. Okay, no, we'll we'll uh, just uh, bring it up to there. Really? Uh... Right, okay. So I have that. That is a uh, hub station. Now, I need a road station, which is going to need to... Uh-huh. So, uh, building. Yeah, it's a building. Yeah, we'll put it in right about here. No. Um, yeah, we definitely want it on this side. Uh... So if I put it there, does that work? Uh, well, it might, but I'm going to need to... No. No. No, that is not where I, what I want to do. I want to go in here, and I want to put a uh, cargo building. Cargo building. Uh, what if we put a cargo building right here? Yeah, we could put a cargo building right there. Uh, yeah, flat. You gr grab the flattening gun a bit. Yeah, we need to flatten this. Yeah. Okay. Now we can grab this thing and put it right here. Uh, give it a little bit of a gap. Yeah, okay. Now, we can go in here. Oh, close that. Uh, and that's going to be the Pueblo Freight Hub, too. Freight Hub. Yeah. Configure. Uh, cargo. Yeah. One, two, three. Yep. Yeah, we can do that. Street access, put one there. Yeah. Okay, that'll work. Now, I need to get a road coming out that way. Right. That's going to need streets. One of these. Uh, okay. Collision. With, wait, what? There we go. Flat. Yeah, flat to there, and then to here, yeah, curvy here, 
Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll cut. I'll do a cut on that. And then you can come here. Yeah. Okay. Now. Um. Right now, I'm gonna need. Uh, I should be able to get away with one, one truck line there. I think. Uh, okay, well, I'm going to need... No, roads. Yeah. Uh, no. Buildings? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll put that there. Yeah. Don't need that road then. Nope. Um, streets. Need one of those. Okay, you can come through there and then bend onto there. Yeah. And then bend onto there. Yeah. That works. Okay. Great. It works. Now what do you, what do you need? Uh, truck depot. Okay, you need a truck depot. Yep. So I'm going to build one. That's generally how one gets one. Uh, okay, good. We have a truck depot. Now, we need to run trucks over to here. Oh, this is going to be a machines factory. Yeah, machines factory. Good. And uh, we're going to grab trucks. Oh, we can let uh, we can let that move now. Cargo. Uh, this one does forty and carries six. That one does thirty and carries nine. And that does 40 and carries 7. We're going to use the bends. I'm going to put 20 of them on here. Which is overkill, but I'm going to put 20 of them on there. Find And then find out it's underkill. New line. Here to here. Yeah. So that is Pueblo or is it PBLO? We're going to call it PBLO here. Um, uh, machines to Pueblo Freight Hub. Okay, and what's line one? That is Green Bay uh, Steel Mill to Green Bay Freight Hub. Yeah, okay. Now, Pueblo. I didn't. Okay, PBLO will, will do. Okay, that's good. We have a thing going there now. Uh, the exciting part: uh, putting in crossovers uh, on these. Yeah. Right now. Um, what do we have running here? Uh, that is boxcars and gondolas. So we need flat cars, I think. Uh, steel, yep. Uh, yes, yeah, uh, it's going to be flat cars. Uh, okay, where's the uh, thing? There's the thing. Okay, locos. Do we have deep? No, we don't have diesel yet. Uh, okay, so this guy is 1150. And that's 1173, 228. Yeah, we're going to use the, the JF1. Uh, cargo. Uh, we're going to come down here for uh, flat cars. So that's 12, that's 8, that's 12. So that one it is, uh, and that carries steel. Yep. Okay. Uh, wait, no. Uh, we want uh, right. So that's two hundred and eleven meters. 
240 capacity. Yeah, we'll we'll go with one of those. Yep. Uh, what I need to do, of course, is come over here and uh, do the crossovers here too, uh, like this. Yeah. Good. We have crossovers. Oh yeah, I'm going to need a couple of signals just to uh, make sure things behave. Yeah. Also here, like this, and like this. And you know what? I'll put a signal in roughly the middle about here. Uh, that way, that way, that way, that way. Okay. Now, uh, we come down here and we new line it from here to here. Pause it. And it's on that side. Uh, yep. Okay. That's, that's exactly what I want. Okay. So that's going to be Green Bay Freight Hub to Pueblo Freight Hub, and that's going to be flat car. Right. Okay. Now, normally, uh, this type of network, you'd be running mixed consists everywhere. Uh, but that's because the consists would be made or broken at each freight hub, right? Uh, you'd have uh, uh, classification yards where uh, trains would come in and uh, pick up their uh, wagons, go to the next classification yard, get broken up, uh, you know, that sort of thing. Uh, and then uh, the actual wagons would go on to uh, other destinations and so on. And that's, that's how it would work, right? But we, can't, we don't have shunting. Uh, and, uh, you know, and for that to work in a game like this, you'd have to have automatic shunting. And, uh, you know, where it automatically routes the wagons and the shunting deals with it and so on, right? Now, it could be done. It just isn't. Okay, so we're at the, uh, the Green Bay Freight Hub. We just uh, trundle on. Uh-huh. Just want to see what this track looks like here. It looks like track, obviously. And we got a tunnel through a hill. Yeah. And autosave. Autosave came. You know, autosave likes to come. Uh, you know, that's what it does, right? It comes. Uh, yeah, we're just uh, tootling along here. Uh, yeah. You know, the freight mainline thing works pretty well here uh, so far when you have only like four trains on it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, but this should get proper busy once it uh, gets uh, better, uh, better organized, right? Right, okay, so here we are at the freight hub. Yeah, look, there's trucks driving around. Right, so... On our way back. Now, uh, if we come back over here, do we have any... Are we actually producing any steel? No, we aren't. Why? Um, oh, because I haven't uh, allowed it to uh, transport them back. Yeah, okay. Well. Why is it... Uh, Okay, whatever it's doing. Um, right. Well, we don't really have room for more um, freight hub. Okay, we'll manage the vehicles. And, no, we'll manage the line. 
manage the line. And here uh, we should pick up the steel, load steel. And here we should, yeah, unload everything. Okay. Now we're taking steel. Uh, good. Yeah. The trucks that can carry everything, we might as well do that. Uh, yeah, we might as well. So, uh, how do we do this so it's a little less janky? Well, uh, what we do is uh, we jankify things by doing this and this. Yeah. And then we do this and this. Yeah. Okay. Now hopefully that will uh yeah, that should uh that should clear the backlog definitely. Looks like it is anyway. Good. Right. Okay. That definitely is doing a thing. And over here. Uh, question is whether we're uh, actually catching up on the iron or not. Right. Okay. Uh, so that will get steel, and we have steel coming here. Um, this one, no. Uh, this one is... Oh, it's coming here. It's going to load up some steel. And then we'll see, see how, how well that's going to pay off when it moves that onward. Okay, well, it's picking up. Well, it picked up 31 steel there. Okay, this is good. Now, uh, do I have a. <clears throat> well, I have lumber here. Uh, do I have. I don't have a lumber mill up here. No. Do I have one over here? No. So I need a lumber mill as well. And then we can make machines. Yeah. Um, yeah, so that that might be a project for next time. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, but anyway, that's a uh, project accomplished for this time. So uh, I'm going to put the cut here. And uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's it's time to uh, mention the Patreon. Uh, I have one. Uh, if for some reason you want to support the channel, go for it. Uh, the link will be in the description. Otherwise, uh, you know, then don't, you know, entirely up to you. Anyway, uh, that's all for now. So see you back next time.